the result set which we are getting by a select statement can be sorted by using the order by clause. So in this particular video, we will see how the order by clause actually works. Basically, when we use the syntax, we will place the order by at the last clause means at the end of the select statement and execution wise as well, it will execute at the last. So let's find something more about the order by clause practically. So as you can see, I am able to get all my 20 records right here along with the four columns EMP ID, first name, salary and department. Now if I want to sort this particular data, how can I do that? By default, you can see my data is sorted on the basis of EMP ID. So whenever you will be making any column as a primary key, so by default all the data will be sorted on that particular basis. But in the output, you may want to get the data in any particular sorted order like first name should be there means the data should be sorted as a first name in the alphabetical order in the ascending order so for doing all that thing here we have something called the order by clause order by clause will basically sort the data as per your requirement for example if I want to sort the data on the basis of salary so what can I do is order by salary as I will execute you can see all the data is sorted on the basis of salary in ascending order. If you want to do the same in the descending order, you can simply say DESC that is descending order. So when I will execute it again, you can see it is coming in the descending order. Similarly, if you want to sort the data in any particular column way which is not available in the select list for example EMP ID first name salary and department are the columns on the basis of which I am I have taken here cell salary column and I have sorted the data but for example I do have a column called last name which I have not selected but you can also do the sorting in that particular column basis as here you can see the data is sorted I can't see the last name but definitely it is being sorted in the descending order as per the last name by default it is always the ascending order but even if you want to put a keyword there is ASC keyword which will give the ascending order so to make the query more uh, clear you can put this keyword as well now let's consider some more scenarios as here you can see there are four columns available you can also pass the sequence of these particular columns. For example, if I want to sort the data as per the salary, so salary is the third column. So here we'll start with one, EMP ID one, first name two, salary three, department four. So since it is the third column, I can also write three ASC, that means ascending. So you can see it's all sorted on the basis of the salary right here, all right? Similarly, if you will say 4, it will sort on the basis of department, right? So 10, 20 altogether, 30 altogether, 40 altogether, 50, 60 and 80, alright? So this is how you can sort the data on the basis of the sequence. Let's consider a scenario where I will use an expression which we have already done earlier. So here we'll use annual salary as the alias. All right, let's execute it again. There's no change in the output, but the thing which I want to share is like here, you can also pass the alias. In the where, as I already told, in where you are not supposed to pass the alias name, but in the order by you can. Why? Because order by clause will execute after the select statement. So by the time your order by will be in action, the select is being executed and the aliasing is done. So you can definitely use the alias in your order by clause. Now let's take one some more scenarios as let's uh, sort them in the basis of descending order. All right, this annual salary in descending order. Now what I want is I want to sort the data on the basis of multiple columns. Let's take a scenario like uh, here, there is a guy, there are a couple of guys who are earning the same salary, all right, 336000, all right, but you can see the name, firstly it's starting with S then A, I want if the salary is same, then 
the second sorting should be done on the basis of first name that's true now I want to sort the data on the basis of multiple columns make sure when I'm sorting the data on the basis of multiple columns the primary sorting will be done on the basis of first column only but when the data of first column is same like here you can see the salaries are same for these two salaries are same for these two salaries are same so similarly you are getting it number of times all right now and that particular time whenever there is something like the uh, first name is not in the sorted like is this in this scenario Angelina should come before Satish so how can I do that is first name ASC by default again it will be ascending but just to make it more clear clear I'm doing that all right and now here you can see Angelina is coming before Satish so this is how you can plan sorting your data in the basis of single column or multiple column where in the order by clause you can pass the column name column sequence aliasing anything